everybody, this is Kevin Purcell for GottaBeMobile.com, and I've got a new mount for my iPad. It comes from Bracketron, and I want to show it off to you today. So this is the Bracketron windshield mount for tablets. It's about $40, and as you can see, it's got a suction cup that grabs onto the window, holds onto a tablet. It does a fairly decent job of that. Up here at the suction cup, as you notice, there's a little lever here, right there. It's got two uh, buttons on each side that you squeeze, you pull up and down, and that's how you release it. Notice it also has a retracting arm here. This part right here, you lower it to lock it in place, push it up, and it will slide in and out. And then you can see right here the dial. Uh, turn that in order to loosen this ball joint. I'm sorry, it, actually this uh, joint right here that will allow the tablet to uh, tilt up and down like this and then there's this dial right here that you uh, use to loosen the ball joint which allows it to rotate in all kinds of different directions and then of course we've got these two arms these both will slide up and down in order to fit the width of the tablet and then on this side you have these clamps and they will go in and out. There's a little lever on the back that holds it in place. As you can see, I plug it in and sort of use this to kind of hold it in place because there's nothing here on the bottom to hold it. There is a little lip here on the bottom of this and this. You can tilt it up like that so that uh, it could be horizontal, which I think is maybe the way they had it intended. But I prefer looking at my tablet in... Uh, uh, or rather in vertical view, I prefer to look at my tablet and use it in horizontal view. So let me show you how you oh, found fasten it. Squeeze, let go, and then it'll come off. So then why would you want to put your iPad mini or Nexus 7 tablet or maybe a Samsung uh, small tablet? Why would you want to put it in your car like this? Well, some people could, I guess, watch videos on it while they're driving. Uh, I think the, the best thing, though, as you can see, I'm opening up the Maps app on the iPad so that you can do navigation. You know, pull over and search for restaurants. There is a, a disc that you can stick on your dashboard with some adhesive. I didn't use that because I'm not going to put anything permanent on my dashboard. And you would put the suction cup on that disc. And so instead of it coming down off of your window, it would come up off of your dash and hold it that way. And then when you want to take it out, this is spring-loaded on this side. And so notice it just kind of pops out, thanks to the fact that it's spring-loaded. It's a little difficult to do uh, with one hand while I'm recording this. All right, so I've brought it inside just to give you a little bit better look at the back. And right here is the lever that comes undone, allows this to retract so you can hold a larger tablet. It will hold the iPad. It can go big enough to do that. Just squeeze that back in. Here's the ball lever. Even with it loose, it still is extremely difficult to move around. And of course these, notice it wiggles pretty easily. When this part goes into that way, it, it will uh, retract. Pull it out and that locks. It will not go anywhere. So what do we like about the Bracketron tablet windshield mount? First of all, it uh, has a decent price at $40. Second of all, it uh, really suctions on very, very well. Uh, all of the joints and everything seem to hold pretty strong, pretty well. What we don't like, we were driving around uh, just using it earlier today and we hit a bump in the road and the whole front part of it just kind of flipped down. Um, it just all of a sudden went, <laughs> uh, and what happened was the ball joint that holds the tablet in place, well, that just didn't do a very good job. This has been Kevin Purcell with the Bracketron Universal Windshield Tablet Mount. For Gotta Be Mobile, thanks for watching.